Okay, so you guys know how I am when it comes to leaks, fake news, real news. If it's real, I'm going to talk about it. If it's fake, I'm going to just try my hardest not to talk about it. If it's fake, if it's rumor, I would say, then there's no reason for me to speak on it until we get that confirmation. But. I felt like this was enough to actually just to debunk and just go over the fact that it is in fact fake. So without further ado, let's get right into the video and keep following me, subscribing, like, comment, and also follow me on my DVNR pages as well as on Twitter. Okay, so right off the bat, first, shout out to the artist of this. This is some pretty legit shit that you did. And I will give you proper credit where your credit is due and given. Second, now right off the bat, you can tell that there are some things about this picture that don't, that seem fake about it. The first thing would be to point out where the placement of Zero Aura and the female trainer in this <clears throat> in the screenshot is now as many of you have probably realized we only had one trailer so far of Pokemon Sword and Shield that's a clear factor so if you look to the ve to the to the right side or well, in whoever's looking to the left of your right side you can still see that the the start the glimmer of when the male trainer from the trailer threw his pokeball now and as you can tell that the shadows are actually displaced as well because as you can see both the, the female trainer and Zero Aura shadows are facing the opposite direction but in the trailer all you see is the male trainer shadow and it's facing to the left not the right well facing to the right not the left now this could like I said I see what they were going for and I see that a lot of people have been you know talking about armored evolutions and stuff like that so really I'm not gonna say too much but I won't I will say that this is a very believable leak but overall like I said and I told everybody this it is very much appreciated that you guys want to make fake information and stuff like that just to show that you know you really are looking forward to these games but in all honesty, let's just let's just hang in there for the fact that the new Sun and Moon, I mean not Sun and Moon, <laughs> the new Sword and Shield trailer are coming at some point before E3, if not at E3. So, let me know what you guys think. Was this a very believable fake or was it not? Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and also follow me in the links in the description box. Until we meet again, my friends.